The E300's Ethernet IP communications module has two Ethernet ports. The two ports act as a switch, allowing the E300 to participate on a linear network, a star network, or a device level ring. A device level ring allows the ringmaster to redirect communications traffic in the event that one of the communication links is disrupted. In this example, we will demonstrate what happens when a network link is disrupted between a device on a device level ring. For this demonstration, we have two E300 electronic overload relays and a Compact Logix L36 ERM. The Compact Logix is configured as the device level ring master. Currently, the L36 ERM is commanding both contactors to be energized via the E300 electronic overload relay. If there is a communications disruption between the Compact Logix and the E300, the Compact Logix processor will automatically redirect Ethernet communications traffic down the other side of the ring. If a second segment of the network is disrupted, the device will go into its failsafe state. By default, the E300 electronic overload relay will open its control relays. When the network link is restored, the E300 will receive Ethernet commands and re-energize the contactor. When the complete ring is restored, the ringmaster will now only send communications down one side of the Ethernet ring.